Today we're out in the hangar, and behind me here is the Sonex Xenos B motor glider. It's got the VW engine installation. So in uh, the last video, I was working on the nut plates that I installed to hold the fiberglass tabs of the cowling on. So this is the upper. The upper has nut plates that are riveted in place. And the lower column here has nut plates to hold the upper column to it. So now that we've got the column uh, all fitted and, and uh, with all the nut plates that it needs, now we have to do the baffle plates. This is an air-cooled engine. The air will come in the front of the cowling and down draft through the, through the fins on this VW engine cylinders and uh, exit out the bottom. So what I'm doing now, I have this uh, rubber seal. So as the cowling goes on, this rubber seal will, provide, will prevent the air from escaping where it's, uh, to where it's not supposed to be. So I have Clicos. Uh, Clicos are uh, generally used in riveting. They're kind of a uh, pin, a spring-loaded pin that holds the metal in place before you you rivet it. It holds it in place. So in this case, we're holding uh, the rubber seal in place with uh, Clicos, and on the inside is a plate here, a backup plate, to give the rivets something to pinch onto because the, they could potentially pull through the rubber all by itself. So we're, we're using on this, uh, the plans call for uh, pop rivets. These are pop rivets. So use a pop rivet tool because with this pop rivet gun or tool, when it uh, when you when you break the stem of the rivet, it makes a pop sound. This is kind of difficult to use. You have to have a wide hands, like as big as Bob Hoover, to pull this. And after you've done two or three of these, it gets really hard, and your hand gets sore. So they make a a uh, air operated one, which is much easier. Just pull a little trigger here, and it pulls the rivet up pulls the pop rivet, makes the same pop sound, but much easier when you're doing a whole lot of them. Like you can see here, we have quite a few to do, as well as the, uh, the rest of the aircraft uh, parts that we're going to do. So that's what I'm working on today. And here's, here's the picture of the airplane. If, you, if you've never seen a, a Sonex, uh, this is the, the original plans that come with it. And uh, this is just a line drawing. So you can see it has quite a big wingspan. With these uh, wingtip, uh, it's I believe 46 feet wingspan. And then the here's the plan form of the airplane, the side view. You can see that uh, it looks like a, a a long Sonics. The fuselage is longer than the regular Sonics. Fixed pitch propeller. Small wheels with wheel pants, and it's a two place. You can see there's two seats in here. So I'll get to work on this. I'll show you how this air gun works. So I've got my uh, Clico pliers and I'm going to take, take one out here. Pretty easy. Now I've got my rivet. Fit that rivet in there. I want to make sure the rivet goes all the way through and the, both pieces of metal are pulled up tight. So I've got a pair of uh, clamp, uh, clamps here. A set of clamps. I'm going to make sure that the metal is nice and tight in there. So when the rivet when the rivet pulls together, it will hold. So let's do a demonstration of the uh, 
hard way, the mechanical one. You'll see how difficult this is. It pulls it up in steps. Ah, so there's, there's that baby. You can see that, yeah. So let's take a look at what that did. There's this side, and there's the rivet side. As long as we're doing the close-ups, you can see the, the all the clicos in here. And these are the rivets. So that came out came out pretty good. Okay, on this next one, I'm going to use the air, the uh, air-driven uh, pop rivet gun. Take the Clico out, and I have the rivet fitted in there. Put my clamp on it. Take that clamp off and see what's going on here. Boom, just like that. Isn't that nice? Quick and easy with this.
So now that this is complete, and we're going to see how it's going to affect the fit of the upper cowling. I didn't have to take the bottom cowling off to do that, just the upper. Look at that. Keep going, whatever. Well, I'm gonna knock off here. I'm just. I wanted to see like how bad it was or how good it is. Okay. It's uh. Whatever. I think it's pretty. You know, it's pretty. Step on the seat. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's not fit. Haven't gotten to the seat right yet. All right. 